Hi, it's Mary Chapel from the Librarian's Literature Links back again to show you some more of the books that I used in my recent letter writing unit with my kids. Um, I've already done a couple of them with you, but this time I wanted to show you the book that I used for my thank you letter portion of the unit. The book that I chose was called 10 Thank You Letters by Daniel Kirk. And we've got two characters, Rabbit and Pig. Uh, um, let me make sure that I'm clear about this. So Rabbit comes over to Pig's house and Pig is in the middle of writing a letter to his grandmother to thank her for a sweater that he had gotten recently from her. And Rabbit decides that he wants to write letters as well. So he ends up writing a whole bunch of letters while Pig just writes the one, which I loved because it gave the kids a bunch of different examples of letters and how you can write different thank you letters saying different things. And then Pig just wrote one really long letter to his grandmother. So I'm gonna share one of each with you so that you get a sense of how the author uses letters to um, convey how we can write thank you letters. Let me find the right one because there were some really cute letters. Ah, here's one. This is one that Rabbit wrote and it says, Dear Madam President, thanks for doing a ducky job. Let me know if you need some help. Love, Rabbit. Of course I love the fact that there's a female president. Then, I'm not gonna share the whole, whole book with you because I wanna honor the author's copyright, but I am gonna share the last page with you, which shows the letter that Pig wrote to his grandmother. Dear Grandma, thanks for sending the great birthday sweater. Did you know my favorite color is purple? The weather has been cool, so I can wear the sweater every day, even when I'm helping mom wash dishes or sweep the floor. Yesterday, my best friend Rabbit and I were laughing at a funny book, and my loose tooth fell out. Oh well, I'll grow another one. Anyway, thanks again for the sweater, and I hope that you are well. Love, Pig. This book worked out really, really well for the thank you letter unit that I did. Um, I think that it gave my kids a great example of how to write thank you notes. So if this is something that you think you can use, hop on down to your local library to check it out. Thanks for joining me today. Bye.